Right, hello and welcome to the Geek Lab. And in front of me, you will see a projector. A, this is a smartphone projector. Put your, your smartphone in the back of it and it projects a, uh, an image, sort of, of your smartphone. And I made this a while ago and I am genuinely surprised how much interest there has been in this video. And a lot of people have asked me to make a tutorial to show how to build it because they cannot follow the instructions. So that is what we're going to do now. So what I'm going to do, put this away, and get out uh, the second one, which I had to order to do this video, and I'll show you how to put it together. Be right back. Right, when you order your uh, smartphone projector, you will get two boxes. This one and this one, obviously. This one contains the optics, so for now, we can put that safely aside. We want to concentrate on this bugger. Now, inside this bugger, you will find, you've possibly already found, if you're looking at this video, uh, three boards. I believe there are three different boards. One, two, three. Yep, three boards, which are very confusing when you first look at them. And the instructions, which we have here. Now, what you need to concentrate on is this part. The instructions shows you which board is A, B, and C. So, on the instructions, the first thing we need to do is look, as you can see, at uh, number... Yep, we need to look at A. So, if we find A, which has the mirror in, so... Possibly this one. Ta -da. Yeah. Yeah, there it is with the mirror. And if we put it in the shape it shows you on the instructions. Yeah, it's huge. Uh, not going to fit in my camera easily. So all I'm going to do is raise the camera and we'll be right back. Right, I've got the camera fully up and it doesn't quite uh, fit in screen, but we'll have to make do. Right, the other thing you'll need for this is uh, double-sided sticky tape, so I've already prepared some squares of that to go on. So let's have a look at the first part of the process. Now, according to this, this has to be the other way up. So, we put this thing this way around with the mirror. Ooh. Yeah, it's big for the stable. Put the mirror on the top right there. We then fold this over so that it's like so. Are you seeing? Yes, you are. Right. So, what we need to do is fold that over. We've then got these sticky things. Yeah. Fold these tabs over and fold those tabs in. These ones at the back need to be stuck, so get some double sided sticky tip. Put that on. See if I can, uh, yes, take it back enough. Success! Doesn't usually go that simple. I'll have to do the same on the other side. out if it takes too long but it's been fine uh, right so you need to stick them in there the best done like that as you can see it is not the easiest process in the world anyway so they stick down like that and then that folds up like that I'm not sure if you need to stick that down. Oh no you don't because uh, is that freeloading or what freeloading? Right so anywho uh, well they stick as well okay apparently they stick so one there Come on. 
see the uh, double sided sticky tape is not included, which is a bit mean to be honest. Could have done that. That's taking the whole tape off. Right, so there we go. And then that just sticks down like that. Sort of. <laughs> I hope you're following this. Anyhow, right, next stage. We need to fold this over. So, hang on. That appears to go there. And then that goes there. I'm trying to work this out. that uh, that little flap underneath I have to change the camera angle to this. right you will notice there's a little flap inside that says stick it's all very awkward so that comes down and right if you fold that flap flat it will stick to the bottom here so that's that's sorted right <laughs> well sort of it comes back off right next we have that one and we need to fold this up and there's another sticky tab here so that's going to stick to there I'm just going to put some cell tape on that I'll be right back right I've got some sticky tape on there so I'm just going to fold that up push that together we want to be together right okay so we've got that sorted and that's there now we need to fold that back go into this and then it comes back on itself we've got another sticky zone on the side here so i put some cell tape onto there backing off Okay, so on this side, that is now going to rotate backwards and stick to there. We have the same with the other side. So that sticks on there. Take off the backing. And we can fold this side back. And onto there. Hmm. And these can then fold backwards on themselves like that. That makes the insert for the inside of the projector. Uh, right, so that's like that, that's like that, that's like that. And apparently, there we go, this rotates. section is able to rotate like so that's where your phone will go in eventually all right let's have a look at the next part so the next part we need to get uh, B cardboard B now, I don't believe on B it does say B so yes this is piece B and it does actually state on it B, which is handy. So what we need to do with this, we need to get the black part. We need to turn it over. Okay. And fold in that piece and that piece. Apparently. We can then let's have a look. Ah, right. Just working this out as I go. Okay, we then need to get section A. Uh, don't think there's any particular way around for this. Okay, that comes up. 
It might be the other way around. That comes up. That comes up. Uh, we then need to bring the sides and they fold over like so and we have sticky points we like sticky points well it looks right so yeah we need to uh, put some sticky tape onto these on all four points and uh, stick them down again be right back okay once they are all stuck down on all four sides uh, you can get the lens out of its box and poke it through there it is a bit fiddly but you'll get there eventually and even now my lens keeps moving so yeah a bit fiddly pokely so the next and the last stage is the outer case. You will notice now that this slides inside. Excrement. Right, so now we're going to build the outer case, which is this last part here. So, all we do with this one, a bit of jiggery pokery, fold up the sides, fold the tabs, repeat on both sides. There we go. You'll now need let's have a look, make sure I'm doing this right. Hey. Right. You will now need to fold the sides up so that they come up the side of here and match up with the top like that. Folding like that. I shall just put some solid tape on this and I'll be right back. Right, once constructed, your box is going to look like that, all folded and taped together. There we go. And all that's left to do is to put that. All that's left to do, he says, overconfidently, into this box, push it through, and then. Ta da! We'll uh, drop the camera and look at the last bit of the process. Right, all that's left to do is pull this box out, flip up the mirror. Inside you'll see the place where your smartphone goes. <coughs> you'll need it to be playing whatever movie or video you want it to be playing. Fold this back down and then you slide this in and out to get focusing. And that is it. That is how you build the Avon smartphone projector and if you feel sorry for yourself having built one feel sorry for me i've had to build two so if you've enjoyed this video please subscribe if you want to see the original review video there is a link down below to that too uh, there's also our social media links uh, down there to our busy facebook group etc and uh, yes again please subscribe and if it's been of use please like uh, or if you've got any comments or questions please leave them in the comments box below other than that thank you very much i hope this has been of use you need to quit being dirty you're a dirty boy